Hello everyone and welcome back to another enlightening video where we delve into the timeless wisdom of Stoicism. Today's topic is particularly relevant in our fast-paced, often chaotic world. We're going to explore the 16 critical times when staying quiet is not only beneficial, but essential, according to Stoic principles. If you're ready to cultivate a mindset that brings peace and wisdom to your everyday interactions, you're in the right place. Before we dive in, make sure to hit that subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and give this video a thumbs up if you're excited to harness the power of Stoicism in your life. Now, let's embark on this journey together as we explore the 16 critical times to stay quiet through the lens of Stoic wisdom. 1. When you're angry. Anger clouds judgment and can lead to words and actions that you might later regret. Marcus Aurelius reminds us, The best revenge is to be unlike him who performed the injury. When anger surges, take a step back, breathe, and stay silent. This pause allows you to regain control and respond thoughtfully, rather than reacting impulsively. 2. During heated arguments. Arguments often escalate when both parties insist on having the last word. Epictetus taught, it's not what happens to you, but how you react to it that matters. By choosing silence in the heat of the moment, you avoid adding fuel to the fire, allowing for a more constructive discussion once tempers have cooled. 3. When you're listening to criticism. Listening to criticism can be challenging, especially if it's unwarranted. Seneca advises us, we suffer more often in imagination than in reality. By staying quiet, you can listen fully, assess the validity of the feedback, and respond with composure. Silence here is a tool for growth, not a sign of weakness. 4. In the presence of gossip. Gossip thrives on participation. Marcus Aurelius emphasized the importance of minding one's own business. Waste no more time arguing about what a good man should be. Be one. By refusing to engage in gossip, you maintain your integrity and avoid the pitfalls of spreading or entertaining harmful rumors. 5. When you don't have all the facts. Speaking without complete information can lead to misunderstandings and misinformation. Epictetus reminds us, we have two ears and one mouth so that we can listen twice as much as we speak. Stay quiet until you have all the facts and your words will carry more weight and accuracy. 6. In the midst of overwhelm. Overwhelm can make us feel pressured to react immediately. Seneca's wisdom, if a man knows not to which port he sails, no wind is favorable, encourages us to pause and find clarity. Silence in moments of overwhelm allows you to gather your thoughts and act with intention rather than haste. 7. When someone else needs to speak. Allowing others to speak without interruption is a sign of respect and empathy. Marcus Aurelius advised, be tolerant with others and strict with yourself. By staying quiet, you create space for others to express themselves, fostering deeper connections and understanding. 8. When facing provocation. Provocation is designed to elicit a reaction. Epictetus taught, any person capable of angering you becomes your master. By choosing silence, you refuse to give power to the provocateur, maintaining your composure and dignity. 9. During moments of reflection. Silence is crucial for self-reflection and introspection. Seneca observed, as is a tale, so is life. Not how long it is, but how good it is, is what matters. Taking quiet time to reflect on your actions and thoughts leads to greater self-awareness and personal growth. 10. When you can't add value. Not every situation requires your input. Marcus Aurelius advised, if it is not right, do not do it. If it is not true, do not say it. 
Staying quiet when you have nothing valuable to add ensures that your words are meaningful and impactful when you do speak. 11. In the face of unjust accusations. Reacting defensively to unjust accusations can escalate the situation. Epictetus believed, first say to yourself what you would be and then do what you have to do. Silence in these moments allows you to remain calm and address the issue rationally, preserving your integrity. 12. When making important decisions. Important decisions require careful consideration. Seneca's advice, begin at once to live and count each separate day as a separate life, reminds us to approach decisions with mindfulness. Silence provides the space to weigh options carefully and choose wisely. 13. During times of grief. Grief is a profound emotion that often leaves us searching for the right words. Marcus Aurelius noted, Loss is nothing else but change, and change is nature's delight. In times of grief, silence can be more comforting than words, allowing space for healing and reflection. 14. When you're in awe. Experiencing awe, whether through nature, art or human achievement, can render us speechless. Epictetus encourages us to appreciate these moments fully. He is a wise man who does not grieve for the things which he has not, but rejoices for those which he has. Embrace the silence that comes with awe and let it deepen your sense of gratitude and wonder. 15. While meditating, meditation is a cornerstone of Stoic practice, offering a way to connect with our inner selves. Seneca taught, we should every night call ourselves to an account. What infirmity have I mastered today? What passions opposed? What temptation resisted? What virtue acquired? In meditation, silence is the medium through which we achieve clarity and tranquility. 16 when planning your future. Strategic thinking and planning require a quiet mind. Marcus Aurelius advised, look within. Within is the fountain of good, and it will ever bubble up if thou wilt ever dig. Use silence as a tool to contemplate your goals and devise a path forward, free from distractions and external pressures. In conclusion, we thank you for joining us on this journey into the realm of Stoicism, where wisdom meets practical application in modern life. Embracing Stoic principles is not about rigid rules, but about cultivating a mindset that transcends the challenges we face in all aspects of life. As we explored the 16 critical times to stay quiet through the lens of Stoic wisdom, we hope you found valuable insights on how to navigate daily interactions with mindfulness and virtue. By applying these timeless principles, may you find greater peace, wisdom and strength in your life. If you enjoyed this exploration of Stoicism and its relevance to modern life, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more content that enriches the mind and nourishes the soul. Feel free to leave your thoughts and questions in the comments below. Until next time, stay wise, stay stoic, and continue your journey towards a life of purpose and tranquility.